everybody for uh, for coming today. Um, just want to say a few things. I know Rita's going to give her testimony, so I'm not going to uh, take away too much time. But I did want to uh, uh, want us all to remember what's what's going on today. Um, this is a miracle and a work of God. Okay. Um, nothing other than that. Uh, I wanted to read some scriptures, uh, but before that, um, the Bible says the salvation is of the Lord. It says that. Uh, in scripture that there are none righteous, not even one. It tells us that none seek after God and that we're dead in our transgressions and sins. Every last one of us, that is. In Ezekiel 36, 24, it says, what God does for us, for his children. He says, for I will take you from the nations, gather you from all the lands, and bring you into your own land. Then I will sprinkle clean water on you, and you will be clean. I will cleanse you from all your filthiness and from all your idols. Moreover, I will give you a new heart and put my spirit within you. Amen. I will remove the heart of stone from your flesh and give you a heart of flesh. And I will put my spirit within you and cause you to walk in my statutes. And you will be careful to observe my ordinances. Amen. See, this is not something that comes from man. This is something that comes from God. The Bible says that uh, you must be born again. That means born from above. It's a new birth. You're a new creation when you're truly saved. Um, there's, there's not much more I can say. I, I hand this over to Rita, but uh, to God alone be the glory. Let me go to hell without knowing what the true gospel 
sin. Um, and I must make it feel sorry for my sins, but I didn't repent. Um, in December, I went to a sermon that um, Josh preached at, and um, I heard truth. For the first time. Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. 